Well, so much for the ease of being your weekly upload. Right, I'd like to uh, first off apologise for taking so long with the episode 2 upload. I know I said during episode 1 I'd try and make it a weekly thing and try and get some filming done while I was having my surgery or on the day of my surgery, which is the week after I uploaded this. I just couldn't do it. It was uh, after the surgery, it was just recovering, feeling groggy. I had to inject myself every single day with blood thinners to make sure that I got no blood clots in my leg. They made me tired. I was just tired all the time, lying in bed, conked out, couldn't do much of anything. So it was just recovery. Um, after I actually got a little bit better towards the end of my recovery, it was also just waiting for the biopsy results because as I mentioned in the first video, uh, the one in my chest, the one in my leg showed up red and hot on a PET scan, which could potentially mean cancerous. So um, just waiting for those was really a downer. I mean, I was down about it. My mum was down about it. Just everyone around us was just so depressed, wondering what it would bring. Scared, depressed, just everything. And I just couldn't bring myself to make this part two because I was just so down about it all the time. Um, so I'm sorry about that, but um, yeah. And uh, anyway, I got the results of my uh, biopsy back uh, a few weeks ago, and they came back benign. So I'm uh, that's fantastic. I don't have cancer. They weren't cancerous. They were um, they were what's called atypical, which is halfway between benign and malignant. But um, the more benign than malignant, so they do just say, right, it's benign. After that, I don't really have an excuse to why I didn't make part two or upload it. It was just getting back to work, finding the time after work. Um, it was the Christmas period, so obviously everything was a lot busier. More hours at work, more time at work, just longer days. And when I was getting home, I was just knackered and um, I just couldn't have the energy or the mood to make and upload and edit part two. So I'm sorry about that. That wasn't anything to do with me getting better or getting my health back on top like the first two reasons. It was just the fact that I'm lazy and I just didn't have the energy or the the mood to stand in front of the camera and make episode two. So for that, I apologise immensely. I am very, very sorry and I hope you can forgive me. Um, now, uh, now that I'm... Uh, back to full health and uh, recovering very well. I'm hoping that um, that I can start uploading on a weekly or at least a fortnightly basis to get the rest of these living with neurofibromatosis videos up for you to enjoy and watch. I can't make any promises because at work I'm swamped at the minute. The New Year rush, the Christmas rush, all that. It's just a lot of hours at the minute. So once uh, once things die down at work a little bit and I've got a lot more time on my hands, I'll have a lot more time to plan out what each episode is going to be about, make, edit and upload for you to watch. Um, so that's the reason why I've been gone for however long it's been. So I'm very, very sorry about that. And um, I hope you all had an absolutely fantastic Christmas. And you're going to have an amazing new year. And I hope 2017 was good for you. If it wasn't, I hope that 2018 is a lot better for you than 2017 was. And I promise during 2018 I will be uploading as regularly as I can. And I'll try and make some funny, helpful, any kind of videos I can think of. And if you have any ideas whatsoever or what time you're going to... Sorry, what kind of videos you would want me to make, please don't hesitate to comment in the comment box below. Um, anything nasty will just either be deleted, reported or ignored, so don't put anything stupid. Only decent ideas, nothing horrible or anything like that, please. So yeah, so let's get into episode two. <laughs> 